These are the new AirPods Pro. They're $250 and they're also the most expensive pair of earbuds I've ever owned. I've usually stuck to $10 wired earbuds and they've done me fine, but as a wireless solution, this is pretty legit. Now, are they better than the $200 AirPods with the wireless charging case? Yeah, definitely. You also get a lightning to USB-C cable and a variety of sized ear tips if the medium ones attached don't fit well. These AirPods Pro look similar to the AirPods, but with a shorter stem. I think the styling is pretty cool, better than the original AirPods since they've trimmed down some. And as far as sound quality goes, these are a huge improvement to the AirPods. One, because they're in-ear instead of on-ear, so they seal for a tight fit. But two, the speaker driver and amplifier also provides a much richer and fuller sound with a lot more low end for bass and thump and the highs don't get distorted like I found with the original AirPods. And they come with active noise cancellation technology to block the sound around you, and it works pretty damn well. But this can also be turned off, or you can enable transparency mode to still listen to your music, but hear things like traffic noise or just general background noise for those times that you need it. A few other things to note is that the AirPods Pro come with a pressure sensor on both the left and right AirPods, so you can change modes with noise cancellation. Obviously, you can use the sensor to also play and pause music or skip or go back a track. They're sweat and water resistant. They're made with a vent system to equalize pressure. They're incredibly easy to pair with your iPhone, just make sure Bluetooth's on and open up the case. As far as battery life goes, Apple says that you'll get about four and a half hours of listening time from a full charge and an hour of listening time with only five minutes of charging. Not to mention the case can be wirelessly charged and that wireless charging case can give you more than 24 total hours of listening time. I'm pretty impressed. They're not the best sounding pieces of audio I've listened to, but compared to the original AirPods, that is the, the first gen and the second gen, AirPods Pro is a definite upgrade. Now, if you're not a fan of in-ear earbuds, then that's another story. And whether $250 is worth it is yet another story. But as a standalone product for what it is and what it can do and its competition around, it's pretty fucking solid. Yeah.